Hi, this is a video about how you could upgrade your speakers on the Mini Cooper Countryman. In order to access your speakers, what you need to do is you need to look into this well here. Inside this well, you see that little tab. If you put pressure on the tab on one side, it would flip up on the other side and you have to break, remove that tab. That tab is an expensive part. Just that little tab costs some 30 US dollars, ridiculous. Right, but then make sure you don't you don't break the break the break the tab that is there and underneath here is a little screw right that's one screw there and if you were to go down if you were to go down you should see a next screw here you see that screw there that screw there so that's the second screw that you had to remove and once you remove those two screws it just a lot of clips right through that you have to be brave and pull out right and as you pull out you make sure that you don't break the mechanism that is there for this one so there are lots of wires there's wires for the speaker that are on the on the frame itself and then there is a wire that connects the lock door and there are white wire for the led and there's a wire for the this thing so you remove all those connections and you should be able to upgrade the speakers inside okay so if you want to add the tweeters here so those cars that didn't come with the premium system what they have is they have a blank off here so you have to buy this housing and you could choose the harman kardon speaker or bang olufsen speaker or or the bimatech speaker or whatever you would want to and then add a y cable splitter between this speaker and the tweeter and then you should be able to connect it okay and to put back everything right so you just have to reverse the steps and put back the screw here in this and the screw in the bottom and you should be good for the front doors right if you want to change the if you want to change the the light underneath the light underneath all you have to do is put a spudger here and put pressure and this light would would pop out and you could change it to uh, have a plain light or something with a logo and that kind of thing yeah so what i have here is the bimotech speaker with the bimotech alpha speaker with the cone and that's what making it shine there yeah yep and for the rear speaker it is it becomes interesting because for the rear speaker what you have for the rear speaker is those cars that didn't come with the with the premium system they would have a grill only for the mid-range speaker but if you are upgrading or you're adding a tweeter to your car what you need to do is you need to change this grill on your on your rear door so for changing the grill on the rear door what you need to do do the same thing remove this whole whole interior trim right with the same two screws that are there okay and then the original grill that would have been there on your car right what it would be is it would be plastic welded to the rest of the trim so you have to carefully break that plastic welding put your new grill the premium grill and then put some crazy glue or a little heat and weld it back with the best that you could do and once you do that you will see this new hole for the tweeter on the rear door and then you need to add a cable between this speaker and the tweeter and then your tweeter here will start to tweet right and you put back everything back together right in this door too you could do the same thing you could change the light that is there yeah and that is about it so this door also has a little well and the well has a tab and beneath the tab is a screw that you need to open in order to access right now remember as you add more speakers you need to code your car to be able to get better sound yeah